I swear to God. Hello. <laughs> Apparently, my computer just ran out of memory, which has been happening a lot recently. I think I have to do some, some, um, I think I have to change my computer a little bit. I think something fucky is up with my computer, which I'm not a huge fan of, if I'm completely honest. Something is eating my RAM. Probably Chrome. Uh, so I'm going to close that down. I'm just going to close, close those little babies. Close that. I'm just going to close every single software that I have, including Spotify. Shut that down. Yes, I don't need that. <laughs> Computer is bad. It does not want to do what I want to do. So we are going to... Oh, great. Steam is also crashed, apparently. <laughs> My entire computer just, like, want almost self-destructed. <laughs> This keeps happening. I don't know why. I need a better computer. I got this. This computer is a great computer, but apparently not good enough to stream. We were having close in order to play Skip Six Guns. Damn. Okay. I'm going to do one more attempt. One more. If it does not work. If it does not work. I will play. Uh, workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. But if it does work, we'll play this. But if, if, if it's fucky one more time, I'm giving it one more chance. I'll, 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 I'll invoke communism on, on this game. I, I, I will accept some, some neoliberal shit, bullshit when it comes to City Skylines, but only once. Okay, and in the spirit of that, I'm going to not even change over. I'm going to wait. I'm not give. I'm not gonna give the. Also, if if the game crashes again, please just stay here, please. I don't want to like lose a bunch of people. Maybe another map. Maybe maybe um. Maybe mountains were bad. Maybe the mountains were 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 is where the issue <laughs> is where the issue came in. So I'm just going to try another map. Just just to see if, if the game crashes. So let's see. We cannot see the game. I know. There's... There, okay. I just wanted to set everything up before before trusting this computer again. This is like watching surgery. <laughs> I'm also wondering if it's a if it's like a mod or something that's like killing it and Streamlabs at the same time. Oh, I heard that. My city's crashed before she. Built. <laughs> Come on, modder pack, yes. Europe normal prefabs, yes. China pack, yes. Custom assets. Your properties. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful at this. It's going well. It's not moving. Oh. Huh. It's... <laughs> Good evening. Good evening. 
Yes! At last! My god, what a hilly map. Alright! We did it! <laughs> the game's working! Uh, Gold FM is the one that I'm not supposed to play because that will. that's copyrighted. Or maybe all that jazz is the bad one. I don't know which one is the bad one. I think Gold FM is the one I'm not supposed to click on, and then because then Twitch will destroy everything. But I'm gonna put on all that jazz. Oh fuck, that's loud actually. Let's not let's not do that. <laughs> that's hella fucking loud. Uh, maybe I'm gonna lower the game volume a little bit because I can he see that the wind is like fucking around. Okay, calm down. You're not. How's that? Does that sound good? I'm just gonna double check what's uh, cities, skylines, copyright, music. If you go to options and go to audio, what? Gold FM, cool. So we're just not gonna play Gold FM. <sighs> Welcome to our town. We can play. We can play City Skylines for the first time. Look at this. It's gonna be beautiful. We are going to make the wonderful town of New Fuckburg. It's gonna and it's going to be. It's gonna be the best city. We're gonna have so many things. It's gonna be amazing. Uh, so let's start by building a little entrance way to our town. I'm, I'm so, I'm so fucking uh, happy about this, like you have no idea. I love this game so much. very basic sort of starter setup. Um, we have some nice farmland up here on the hills, which is nice. We have some nice forest here. We can maybe have a little forest forest industry. Spammer? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Be gone. So obvious, obviously, we are going to like integrate other sort of entrance ways into the town up from up here. We have a railway over here, for example. Yeah, there's roads over here. There's roads all over the square, so we don't need to have like the best sort of traffic flow right now. But we're gonna do our best. So let's start simple. Yeah, the basic road. And we're gonna start making a small little suburb area. This is going to be a little town center. We can start having an industrial area over here. So let's do something like something like that. Mm, let's start having some water, and we're not gonna do 
we're not gonna have an outflow pipe because the game the game works it has a water system and also a water pollution system but i'm not gonna pollute the water too much because i want to have a fishing industry later on so we're gonna have an inland water plant what kind of porny music is this Hello, welcome to porn. Let's have, um, uh, I don't really have, I can have wind over here, but that's like uh, far away. Let's start with the one coal plant, but we're gonna become, we're gonna go environmental very soon. So let's lay some pipe. With this, with this music, we're definitely laying some pipe. Mm, that's not gonna work. So let's, the game is paused. I played this game before. Come down. <laughs> so this is going to be a sort of commercial center of town. We're gonna leave. We're going to leave this like um, what's it called? Inroad. We're gonna leave that open for now. We might put some sh shops shops in here depending on how traffic flows. Uh, but for now, it's gonna we're gonna leave it a bit empty. And this is gonna be industry a bit bit separated from from the rest of our town we're gonna farm industry over here but farm industry is doesn't produce a lot of pollution so that can be closer to homes uh, this produces a lot of noise there's a lot of heavy traffic okay let's let's begin our our first suburb That for now we might let's make that symmetrical actually can we do that without too much too many issues yeah sort of it's gonna be close to the industrial area but I can just expand it like upwards rather than down that might be fine I apologize for talking a lot to myself okay let's Let's not expand anymore, because I'm going to run out of money. <laughs> Welcome to Horny Music. Horny Town! <laughs> Great, I want to know my location. Central City Mood. The, all the transit? Oh, are you? Yes. Um, so let's add something here, like in the internals. We don't have to add outside for now. We can add it here to... No, let's keep these. No, actually, let's make that as a central thing. Because when if you're coming in from the suburb, then they, they can be like shop, shops on both sides to sort of signify where you're going. And then let's do. Yeah, how much can I afford? I can, I can afford enough, I think. Let's make a. It's a very basic power line like that. Hmm. Okay, I can't do much right now because I, I haven't unlocked anything, but that's that should be good. Okay, and now we wait. I have a bit of money left over, which is nice because you start you don't start with a lot. And of course, they build on the other fucking side of town and not like close to where the electricity is. Sure, okay, that's this is why you can't trust private contractors. Um, for now, this is a, this is a again a temporary electricity line can I deactivate you <laughs> you're very annoying I think you need a mod to do that just gotta make the roads emergency uh, accessible to emergency vehicles yeah uh, so I have I have a plan I have a plan to make a town somewhere that there is no outside road connection to but that that has its own sort of emergency vehicle supply in the town but the only way you can get to the town is by transit so there will there's no cars like in the town itself that's my that's my that's my thing <laughs> video game violence Someone plays almost exclusive volume. I agree with pretty much everything inside. Media thing there, edges and done. 
this is a good idea. Yeah, I think that I think that'll be interesting. I need more houses, but you have you have all you need. Just please move in. Okay, so here you can see how the how the mod that I'm using is is changing because this household, for example, has two people living in it because the mod actually takes this into account because as you can see there are like two there's one like one house here one house here and then one, like one sort of pathway into the back which looks like an error but it isn't um whereas this house is just for one person this house big but still for one person um these houses also also for one people this one one house one family one household um but then these houses that are like bigger, that can that are obviously two houses because they have two front doors, they have two households. One household. And uh, this also affects like how many people work in shops. So like this this corner shop has 26 employees. What? It's a it's a laundromat. You need like two employees. Well, I don't know how that works. Let's increase the speed. So we can get a little but you know, it, it it changes the values basically on how many people can work in any given building to make it more like realistic. Does that mean I get less access from? Yes, it does. Which which makes suburbs bad, which they are. <laughs> can you put your main mods uh, down this time? Perhaps in the YouTube description. Oh yeah, I can do that. Remind me to do that. I'll 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 show off my mods so you can play like I do. Still have zones that can be used. Come on, do you, do you, or do you just want to be in this like neighborhood area? Apparently, okay. Well, fine. I'll I'll build in the outskirts of that like little area. I just need people. Uh, the drawback of this is before you unlock high density residentials, because you need seven and a half thousand people to do that. Uh, you will have masses of suburban sprawl all over your city. That's that's just the way it's gonna be. And now you can do the thing where you unlock everything immediately when you start the game, but I don't want to do that because I think that's boring. Uh, another thing, like yeah, this fish stick factory has 25 employees. I think usually it has something like 10 or something like that. I think. I only play with the realism population mod because I think it's more fun. It, it makes it look like... Um, it makes the city look more realistic because the downtown cities become really fucking dense. And you need transits then. Fish stick based economy. Listen, New Fuckburg doesn't need much. Can you please build over here though? Like I, you, there we go. Oh, they don't even have water. Maybe that's why they don't have water. I recant my complaints. Oh, I don't have enough money. Well, well, most of them have water anyway. Can I increase taxes? I cannot. <laughs> well, I guess I can lower the budget for the coal power plant by 50% because I don't really need that much power right now. It's saving me some money. That's good. More people moving in. Let's just add more zones here as well because apparently I'm gonna need it. No, I still need money. That's fine. There's not really many houses in the Bay Area. <laughs> it feels silly, it feels silly having like seven people in a house in every house. Yes, exactly. That's that's exactly how I feel, which is why I prefer to have like a bit more realism in my thing. Like this, well, it's one household, two households. It works out. This music is the porniest thing I've ever heard. Uh, let's go to the city's radio. I don't know what that is. Oh, the Stellaris. Hey, we have become a little hamlet. New Fuckburg is now a little hamlet, which means we unlock some nice things. Perfect. So let's begin by building a recycling plant. 
uh, we're going to increase taxes on everyone up to 11%, which make which tells you that this um, is not made in Sweden. Uh, we're going to make a small clinic in the center of town. Perfect. That looks right next to Yixu Energy. Perfect. It's probably healthy. And let's build a small school in a suburb. Let's build it in the, this corner here. Uh, we can afford things now, so let's put the budget up for the coal plant so we have electricity and we don't have to worry about that. The mighty monorail. Maybe, well, maybe you'll get a monorail. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. Can I buy another stretch of land? I cannot. I don't know when I get that. Well, I don't want you to sing. Lights, camera, movie. There's nothing like watching a movie to take no. you to another place. I'm speaking. Okay. Um, we can now sort of delete the sort of temper most of this like temporary um, uh, electricity line, which is good to do because they they cost maintenance money, so you know it's not perfect. Let's start to increase our massive suburban sprawl, which we are going to have to do. Um, yeah, we can we can go down here a little bit more. Do some more sub suburban squares. We can make these squares more dense by putting a line right through them like this. And this will give us a few more houses here and there. But I want to try doing a bit looser for now. And if I can manage it. Uh, just because uh, we are going to... Like, we're eventually we're going to use high residential. And I feel like using these gaps is going to be very useful then. Uh, but we don't need to do it right now, so we're good for now. Let's do it like that. It should be covered, yeah. Cool. One of my biggest issues with the game is high density housing has extremely low populations for really large buildings. It breaks my immersion. Yep, I agree. And that's why I have the mod. It fixes that. Which means that skyscrapers have hundreds of people in them, I think. Which means that like an individual skyscraper will produce a lot of traffic. And suddenly, you need to actually think about that. The levels of the, of the high density matters now. The value of land matters. Like, it just makes everything matter more. We're making some nice money. The uh, recycling doesn't have water, so let's fix that. And now they can go and collect people's garbage. Perfect. Let's slow down a little bit and expand here. I'm gonna delete this. Uh, I'm gonna delete this road a bit later, replace it with something else. Um, plumbing infrastructure, we're doing well, and other, in other areas. Like, we don't need shops, we definitely, we're definitely not gonna need a lot of them right now. Uh, so it's a bit useless to actually build it but it's always good to have because then we never have to worry about expanding that ever again uh, like for example we could we could do with our industry just a little bit just a touch um, but you know it's, it's always good to have people work somewhere and you know eventually it will give us more taxes I also want to avoid um, 
doing like as dense as physically possible if I can because I feel like it makes the towns uh, a lot prettier or makes it uh, it makes it flow better. What a range from I know. God, what a comfortable game. Like, I feel like this game really, like, scratches my itch of... Especially when streaming, like... I just want people to be comfortable, you know? I want people to... I want to I wanna provide some, in some way, a way for people to sort of just relax a little bit. And if I can do that in any way, then I'll be happy. And I feel like this game... It really scratches that itch, you know? I have new apparel. Italian leather, Italian threading. Pernu is Italian. No. No. I am going to change the radio station whenever I hear people speak, by the way. I don't want to hear anyone talk. You think I became a streamer? Uh, well, YouTuber? So I could... I also got, specifically for the stream actually, because I realized I didn't have it, uh, the DLC called uh, Modern City Center, and I'm gonna convert all of these commercial buildings to Modern City Center buildings, because I think they look very good, especially the ones in the middle. Uh, you know, out outlying like shopping districts and everything that I'm gonna add in later, those can be a bit, whatever, I don't really care about them, but um, you know, I just wanna, I just wanna have it as it is. How are people doing so far, though? 200 households, 600 workers. The fuck is the black one? <laughs> what? We have a nice even distribution, mostly adults, because people move in. It's not attractive. We have no, no people. We have some seniors, even. Look at that. Okay, but everyone has, a, everyone has slots to sort of expand. Let's expand the industrial area. Just let's just a touch. Just so they have it. What I really like about this is, um, because this this like um crossway works most suburban people will like go up here they'll go like this they go in here but well uh, heavy industry will just go down here and up here there's never like any cross heavy industry doesn't really go into the town except for like delivery vehicles to sit to 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 places how is my garbage processing good we're doing recycling we we don't have a landfill here kowloon vault city oh my god in this hellish world yeah how accurate do you think these games are to IRL urban planning? Not a lot. With a lot of mods, like a significant amount of mods, it could work. Uh, but it's a very like idealized version of city planning because you're not thinking about like, because you know you I come in I come in here with a, like a blank slate and can like make a planned city. Most city planning has to, has to deal with like well how will this new development impact the current community and how will that work. It's <laughs> losing to Skylands here while playing Workers and Resources. <laughs> I love Workers and Resources. I love it. And that money, I mean, you know, that money series. Yeah, it's almost a year old now. Um, would you have done what would you have done in the final round so if you don't know what I what what have what that is the money series uh, I did a collaboration thing with uh, Tom Scott who of, of Tom Scott fame who is more who's far more famous than I am um, on on YouTube 
I might not do... F actually, this is fertile land, but I might not do farming here. I might, like, do farming area over here, for example. Because, like, this is going to be pretty dense, so I don't know how that's going to be. Anyway, whatever. Let's expand suburbia. Uh, okay, so I did a collaboration thing with Tom Scott. Uh, it was his show, uh, and he, he, he... It was, like, his idea thing. Uh, and he very kindly invited me to play a sort of game theory game where you... Oh, we're a worthy village. Look at that. Uh, where you, you know, you're you're a bit of a scamp. And you, uh, using like trickery, you are like, take you're making money somehow. And in the very end, uh, whoever had like won the most tokens of whatever one thing. I don't fully remember the game. <laughs> Um, they got control of a briefcase that I think had ten thousand dollars in it, and they, and then everyone else would vote on the distribution of that briefcase, depending on the offer that the person gave them. To, it's very hard to explain because I'm not very smart of it. Um, but what I did, uh, I, I I thought I really hoped that I would win the briefcase. What would I do? So what happened in the in the show? Spoilers. Uh, is that we divided the money evenly between all of us as a sort of collaboration like unity thing and it was very we're very kind from everyone um, I would probably not have done that I think I would have I think I would have done a sort of like 50 50 split between myself and everyone else so I would keep half of the money in the briefcase and everyone else would have um, would, would split equally the rest of the money um, because at the time, especially at the time then, like I didn't, I didn't have like regular sponsors on my YouTube videos. Like I, I had significantly less on Patreon. Like I could have, I could have fucking used that money. <laughs> um, but I think, I think, I think that's how I, that's how my mind is. But I think in actuality, I think I would have probably split it evenly in the end, too. Because that was the most like kind thing, you know. I can delete. Um, yeah, it was a fun show. I was very nervous. Tom Scott is a extremely, extremely kind man. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going to develop this suburbia into into the fertile soil because I I want to, and I want to keep it semi symmetrical because I can. It's my city. I I am I am the god of this of this of this land. Look at that. Look at that. That's beautiful. Let's start fucking with it. <laughs> mm. City center. Let's expand that like a tiny amount. We're gonna we're gonna go down here too, so we may as well do that. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. and up here too. Down downtown downtown, it's just downtown. You are going to be the modern city center, and just watch how all the old buildings have to. Have to disappear. No? Did I do it? I did do it. Wait, hang on. Why aren't they disappearing? I thought they would. Whatever. Is this City Skylands? Yes, it is. I'm pretty sure it's where I found out about your channel. Well, nice. Yeah, I got a, I got a nice big bump in viewership from, um, from hanging out with Tom Scott for a bit, which I'm very thankful for because I, I am not very popular. <laughs> I should stop saying that. Like, I'm a professional YouTuber. Like, I'm doing fine. I, just, I really need to stop, like, selling myself, myself short. Like, I'm fine. I sound like I'm such a complainer. I have more money than I thought that I would at this point. Can I build? Oh, I need cops. Damn. Let's build a small police station there and a firehouse. Let's have that over actually here by the industry. Like there. Because industry 
usually needs that and they have ac easy access to the rest of the town. That's perfect. Yes. Uh, what else can I do? I can make a farming industry uh, area. That's, that's interesting. Um, yeah. Let's let it run for a bit and get some money to our account. I can take a loan, but I don't need to do that. Healthcare is good. Fire safety is okay-ish. It's getting better. Crime is low. We can't do that. We just need to expand suburbia. So, yeah. Get more money. Should probably remove some power lines next to my industry. Can I do that? Mm, not really. Like, yeah. Maybe I did that already. People were too nice on it. Yeah, I think one of the flaws of the, of the money show was that we were, we were all like co-workers in the same like industry. Like we didn't, like I, I hadn't met most of these people before and I probably won't again, but like we're all in YouTubers and we're so, all sort of like in the same industrial space. So it's like, if we're mean on it, like we don't wanna, we don't wanna cause anyone like hurt. And the amount of money, they said that the amount of money was like low enough so no one would get like hurt by that. But like I, I if if someone like scammed me from for like several thousand for several hundred dollars, um, I would be hurt by that because I need that money. So yeah, I, I, you can't really do that. But it was a nice thing. How many mods are too many mods for city builder? Not a, you can use infinite amount of mods. City name. It's a good city name. Um, city time. I've recently heard Sweden change. Uh, let me know, by the way, if the volume is ever like off or anything. I've recently heard Sweden change their policy regarding COVID nineteen. Is it true? Yes, it's it is true. But um, I mean, honestly, we haven't done much. The only thing that really changed is the government is very strongly asking people, like, pretty please stop going to the fucking gym. <laughs> um, and um, oh, I don't have any needs. I just need the need to let the town evolve a little bit. And uh, only eight people can be gathered in a public space now, but that does not include like restaurants or grocery stores or anything else. So it doesn't actually matter. So. Like we're all in the same situation. No, there's no need to be a perk. Yeah. Only you can provide. Do you still work with Nebula? I remember Legal Legal mentioning me a few times. What? Really? Legal Legal mentions me? Really? Oh, I'm glad. I need, oh, I don't really watch that much of Legal Legal, sorry. Um, but he, he's, he's, he's amazing. I've met him once and he's, he's an extremely kind man. Uh, he's the most lawyery man I've ever met in my entire life. Um, uh, and he's also, I think also the most American man I've ever met in my entire life. Um, he mentions me? Oh my god, I'm so happy. I need to check that out. Yes, I, I, I still don't work with Nebula. Well, I don't work... Uh, I am hosted by Nebula. I am represented by Standard, uh, the company, and they are the ones who are, like... They represent me, they represent Legal Legal, they represent H Bomber Guy, uh, stuff like that. Kindness begets kindness. Yeah, I I always, I always want to be kind if I can. Labor Labor Party just unsuspended Corbin. Hell yeah, should never have suspended him in the first place. Dumbass. Uh, what do I need? More people. I need more people. Okay, but let's uh, let's I can buy something new, right? So let's let's maybe buy another urban development, um, and like build a little village somewhere. Like maybe 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 we yes yes. Let's have a little farming village over here. Like it'll it'll take us a bit to sort of build into it, but I think it can work. Um. 
uh, how would that work? This would be like this. I'm sorry, I'm just sort of preparing the infrastructure needed for this. Um, can I do that yet? No, I doubled the population. Oh, well, whatever. Um, okay, so maybe not yet, but soon. Soon. Well, I guess I could build like another like on and off ramp here and just have its own like ecosystem that's like unconnected to to this area and then connect them up later. Oh my god, this music is so loud. Some of promoting up here. Shout out to Ifama guy, you and some other people. Yeah, I, I I'm very. Oh, that's. I need to thank him for that. Six and I'm yours. Nice. Strict lockdown because there's poor relief efforts and certain minorities are starving. Oh shit. Hydrate. I will hydrate. Um, I saw someone mention something about. Legal looks like a character from Mad Men or something. Yeah, he is, uh, but he's kind. He's, oh, hey. I didn't know what that was gonna be, so I like ha I half panicked. Sick. We got more people. So let's build a let's build a library like in the middle of town, like here. Let's get some loans going too, so we can start like really, really expanding our, our, our shtick. Let's get a library and put it there. I, I'm thinking I make this square. Actually, I'm gonna... Bye bye. No, you don't get to. Like this square here. Maybe I make that into like a small park. And then there's gonna be like suburb stuff around it. Like it's gonna be a small park. And like schools and the library can be next to it. I think that could be nice. So that would require me to do this. Also parks is a good way to earn like a little bit of money. You don't earn a lot of money, but you earn a little bit. Cops, healthcare. How are we doing in power? Power production is fine. Water, or everything's fine. Cool. Mm, city park. Let's put the main entrance. Mm, we can't get it to be symmetrical, but you know what? Life isn't perfect. And let's have a side gate in the back of the thing. Let's add some fences to just sort of Just like show the outline of the park. What do you mean space already occupied? Fuck off. Don't snap to angle. Do like that. Perfect. And like so. And that way also there's no zoning in the park so I don't accidentally build anything. That's my logic. Um Done. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm gonna let's let's make it a bit more. Let's make it a bit more fun. Um. Okay, it's not perfect. Like I, I see. I don't worry. I, I can see the flaws. Mm, let's put in some nice little trees. While I'm doing this, I'm also like, as you can see, I'm also um, like I'm making money. I'm letting the game run, so I don't. Sugar maple. Is it the same tree? Yeah, looks like the same tree. Sick. So let's. Mm -hmm. 
Let's do like a little, little foresty patch. Or woodland. You know? So it's a bit more dense. Nice. Beautiful. Let's put in some nice, like, pretty rocks. Can we... Oh, there's water rocks, I think. Perfect. <laughs> God, I love this game. More look at our, yeah. Let's add a cafe next to it so people can hang out next to it. Um, some restrooms by the entrance, perhaps. What is this? An info booth. Learn more about the big rock. A uh, little fountain at the, at the beginning. Yeah. I I low key like like I kind of love this actually. <laughs> I, I did it as a joke, but like this is I I, I kind of love this. It's new Fuckerberg for a reason. Yes, exactly. <laughs> God, I'm so happy. Th see, this pleases me. This, this pleases me greatly. How do I build a national road? I need two gun, two and a half, two and a half thousand people. Okay, well. What if I go up here on a little whim and sort of first of all we can expand that perfectly. Yes, 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 yes. yes. And then up here, because this is a bit up, uh, like up on a hill, we have like another, like small area, like. Middle Heights, yeah. Um, rich asshole. They are European, no. They are, they can be vanilla, but they are Definitely, like self-sustaining. If they have any stores up in rich, in rich Alsal Heights, they are organic and local produce. We should have this normally anyway, but you know, the, the, I just wanna, I just wanna make something like the the, the bougie heights. Uh, let's expand that down a little bit. And let's add some citizens to Asshole Heights, Rich Asshole Heights. What can we do here? What are the policies of Rich Asshole Heights? No, there, I can't do anything. Listen, we have 69 viewers. Like, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta play with the space. Let's, let's give them electricity. While we're at it, let's also like expand like normal suburbs too. Cause we need it. Let's do like that. We can also do more, like more squares here on the outside. So that's, that's good. I'm happy with that. So you can kind of see this, the, the thing that I've been going for. I think this area now I'm going to cool off a little bit on because I think this is going to be like the major transportation hub. Like I'm thinking train stations here, 
maybe some sort of like bus terminal somewhere around here because this is gonna be if this is gonna be high density eventually um like this can be sort of the network of all of it you know so I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna cool off doing this like I'm gonna expand here to the sides but I'm gonna I'm gonna leave this area like a bit free uh, yeah <laughs> Building a city. And then we can add just commercial. Let's expand this out too. So downtown is a bit bigger and includes Big Rock Park. How is Big Rock Park doing? We're making a loss. <laughs> That's okay. It's gonna it's gonna become better when we have more people. Electricity is fine. Water fine. Garbage fine. Sick. High speed. Let let people move in. We don't have a lot of rich asshole living up, assholes living up here, but that's that's okay. Um, we may need to build some smaller park or plazas because the area around Big Rock Park is like beautiful. They love living rec next to next to Big Rock. They love it. Um, but the but the outskirts are a bit neglected. So let's build like maybe a little Japanese garden or something. Or maybe just a small a small park in in one of these like here perhaps and also here so there it's somewhat symmetrical yeah it didn't do fuck all okay well whatever um maybe the rich assholes would enjoy a little japanese park and maybe a little ferris ferris ride how about that are they gonna like that there's no one here so that's creepy as fuck okay that's fine i can have that to terrorize them um, I don't need much right now. Let's actually lower taxes potentially for residential, just a smidge, uh, so that they might be more inclined to move into my town. Okay. You're charging people to go into the park. Listen, it's taxes. <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> Who wouldn't love? Who wouldn't love living next to a bouncy castle? Pebbles up. <laughs> Is this what we're doing? We're doing rocks. Usually I do cults, but apparently this is like we're doing rocks now. A every single park we make, or zoo, or amusement park now has to have rocks in it. And this is the big. This is the big. I cannot. Do I, is there a bigger rock? <laughs> Okay, um, I want your opinion on this. Is this Big Rock Park or is this Big Rocks Park? Because I, there is a bigger rock. Like this rock is bigger than the other one. So one, do we have many huge rocks in the Big Rock Park? Or do we have one, one gigantic rock? And then we have like smaller rocks through, throughout our city. Like, look at this. Oh, this is all big chunker. <laughs> look at these chunkers. Can you, you can't build them in water? Yeah, I think they're supposed to go in the water, actually. I just want to see what kind of rocks they have. Because these, these are pathetic small rocks that only go in small villages. <laughs> like, you can have this. <laughs> I want to make Arizona, <laughs> apparently. Make a bigger rock park. Oh, I like that. Place them at random. Oh. Distribute the rocks around the city. Okay, I'm I'm getting I'm getting the impression that this is big rock park, but we're going to build bigger rock park later. Cause this is a small, this is a small park. So we're going, like eventually, like I'm not sure this is going to be like the, the very, very center of the metropolis that we're gonna build eventually. Um, 
but it might be, you know, like, uh, but it might also be like somewhere over here or like, I might have multiple parks, you know, who knows? No one knows. I don't, I, I for sure don't know. What the fuck's wrong with the ground here? Is this oil? I don't know what that is. That is oil. So that's what I'm gonna do. Restri redistribute the rocks, yes. So every time we build a park, we're going to put a rock in it and name it something like that. A park with a really deep ditch, yes. A hole, <gasps> opposite town. No, I'm, I don't know what, I'm, what the fuck am I talking about? Can I get, can move in, fuck. Um, <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh, these are mods that I have. Don't worry about them, they're not that important actually. Um, I have I have this though. I do we put this here in in our center thing? I have a meteorite park. An asshole lights. Oh my god! Is okay. Can I find a hole? Is there like a ditch? How do I? Oh my god! Why? How is that so big? Small. Um, or was that too small? I I don't know how quick the disasters happen, so I'm just gonna leave it for a little bit. Look at this. Doesn't li doesn't this look exactly like every city's asshole heights? Because every every city has like this, like up on a hill, looking down on the, on the town. That's like slightly away. The very like blocky housing. Hate that. Um. Okay. What else can What else can we do? Let's uh, Let's make a little fishing industry. Just like a little one. We're We're going to access the ocean eventually. But let's uh, Let's have a little salmon fishing. Uh, vibe going on. I think that could be fun. Also because there's a one, one expansion that's like singularly about that. Just down there. Give them some water and some. Uh, they have power. Okay, that's cool. Do, 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 do. The straightest fishing lines. Geologists predict oh. that a sinkhole could strike at any minute. Residents should take precautionary measures. There we go. Fish. Go fisk. Fuck. I mean, it's gonna happen over here, because I... Oh no! That wasn't supposed to happen! A Fuck this guy in particular! <laughs> Please don't destroy my parents' house. I'm sorry. God, it feels so bad for that one guy. So the beaches on the oceanic part of the coast of Rio are super busy. All the ones in the bay just have people on the sand are going into the water. Yeah. Grew up in suburban Chicago. I've been to Chicago. It's, it's, it seems very nice. Also seems very flat. Uh, she, I, I don't know much of Chicago, but Chicago seems seemed great. I'd love to go back someday. Uh, let's add a little... I want to start doing, like, fun, fun like, decorative things. So let's just put... Because there's, no, there's not a lot of stuff happening here, right? So let's... Uh, there's no way to cross over from here to here. So I want to do a... Uh, no, don't touch the holy rock. Like a, like a walking path like this, right? But then also, for people who who just wanna like 
go directly to the fishing place. They can do like that. I think that's I think that looks great. And this way people can walk to the industrial zone a bit easier. Is anyone's gonna is anyone, if anyone's gonna use that, I don't think anyone will. Hey, look at that! One person. I'm happy now. Um we don't really need to do much else with that anywhere else, I think. I'm gonna add this as a service way. We're not gonna have anything. We're not gonna build anything here, but we are going to build the. Okay, we can't build that right now, but we're gonna build the disaster response unit over here because we're gonna need that, I think. Uh, Big Rock Park. Doing well. Making a loss. That's fine. We're having we're having a fire. They'll they'll be they'll be fine. Okay. Mm Again, I just need more people, I think. The next next step is is Boomtown. And then I can do a bit more things. Can I buy another square? No, not yet. Okay. I guess um Yeah, okay. Let's let's make let's make these squares at at last. Let's let's develop suburbia a little bit more. Cool. This should no 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 far too much far too much far too much. I kind of want to have a bit of distance between rich asshole neighborhood and like m like normal people neighborhood. Because I am thinking I may have I may I might run on like a train line or something between here or like some sort of infrastructure. I don't want to. I want to have a bit of di distance between my my urban centers because otherwise you end up with like one huge clump and you have to like navigate your things into that thing. This is a real experience of going to the beach in the middle of the continent. Yeah, um, I, I saw a beach. I was there in the middle. Uh, I was there in the middle of January, so it was like very cold. Mostly snow. I saw the bean though. I love. I, I'd love the. I. I hate the artist who made the bean, but the bean is a surreal experience in and of itself. Okay. Downtown is developing though, like slowly but surely. I don't think the the expansion pack that I got is working though, because it's supposed to be modern city center, and I don't think it's 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 doing that. I think it's just like being normal. That sucks. Five dollars gone, I suppose. That's fine, it's just five bucks. We're doing well with money, our population is like growing steadily. Can we buy a monument perhaps? A statue of shopping. Well I don't I don't want to do that. I could build a football arena or a festival area, but I don't want to do that either. At least not yet. Let's um, okay. The population is increasing slowly. I want to I want to I want to make a small farming community. So I'm going to make one. Uh, I'll figure out how to connect all of this later. It'll, it'll make sense, don't worry. Uh, and again, this is gonna become a, this is a, this is gonna be a very small, like, village. It's not going to be a, um, like, a very, like, dense um, population center. Uh, but we're just getting the infrastructure like ready to go. Why do you not angle? Okay, 
I don't mind. That's fine. So I'm gonna do a small connection to the highway. And hopefully that won't lead people to like tr travel through the city. I'm also gonna make a small bridge. Uh, I think up here. Like a very, very small bridge. Um, and have people travel from... Uh, I'm, go I'm going to develop a small like development zone here for tr for in for commercial uh, not commercial traffic what's it called um for transit uh, and i'm gonna make out that zone and then it's it's going to connect like out and sort of into that zone but the zone itself will be unaffected uh, and obviously i can i can change that later and hopefully this means that like this little village and this like m more like town can sort of communicate Um, we are, of course, going to give. We need to. We need to bless. We need to bless this small community. So we're going to bless it with big rock. I like that the tree. Can can we delete the trees themselves? No, the trees just come with it. That's fine. And we're going to name this town. What should, what should we name this little, little community? This little farming community. They call it, they're calling it the Birch District, but I don't think that works. Meatloaf Rock. Snot vile. Bless this wretched high. The district. When you visit the US, did you, did you feel safe? If I ever go to the US, uh, everyone was armed with healthcare and this. I was only there f flying through. I didn't. I didn't stay in America. I was flying through America, so I didn't. I didn't go there. Rockwell, plant memorial. The cat mom and now she's Rockwell. Listen, I'm, it's going good. Not making much tax money on them to make back the money. That's fine. I, I'm just hanging out. Have I played Crusader Kings three? I have. Let's make. Let's name this. Uh, picking a name at like random ish. <laughs> Flatland. I like that. I'm gonna name it flat. F flat. Flat. Flat rock. Rock. Flat rock farms. That hopefully incorporates a couple of different ideas. Uh, I like Crusader Kings three. I I think it's fun. Um, I don't feel it like I don't think it's as like deep. Or whatever. To um, I'll fix that later. Uh, to um, as as Crusader Kings two is, but that's you know you can't. I, I don't think you can really hold that against it because it is. You know, it is, it is it is a newer game, like a newer title, like and it can't it can't do everything that its predecessor did. It's much much like The Sims, but on the other hand, I also think it's kind of shitty that we keep like waiting for for uh, for DLC for a game that should be complete already. To me, like to me, it doesn't feel complete yet. It feels like the game is like, oh look at this. Or fishy, or fishy boats. The fishy boats! Ooh, fishy boat. God, I love this game. Fuck. <laughs> um, what can I do with fish, by the way? I know I can, I can, I know I can add a fish market. Can I do that already? Yes! Fish market. Uh, where should the where the fuck should the fish market be? In the middle? No, that doesn't make any sense. Um, I guess I can make a sort of like coastal like shopping area that like connects to the to the like transport district. I like that. Let's do that. Mm, okay, it would sort of have to connect. Let's let's do something like like. So we do that and then we go 
like like this. Oh, this is actually very steep. Okay, so let's not build anything on like the this end because that's that's not actually gonna go anywhere. Uh, but we can build on like on this internal area. It's very steep. If you if you fall down, you fall the fuck down. But we can have like some some like shops on on like the more like uh, internal end. Like at the inside of the the road, and the market can be there. I don't know what that gets us, but you know, it's a, it's a video game. I just wanna I just wanna have fun. <laughs> Flat. I just love the fact that we're gonna put rocks everywhere. I love it. Fucking burger fits with the rock theme. Yes. Hearts are for their basic and rudimentary issues that should be fixed, but they're just gonna But they're just going for endless uninteresting deals. Yeah, I don't I don't like that at either. Like, yeah. Is river fishing an actual industry? I thought it was just something people do as a hobby. It is an it is an industry in very certain very specific rivers. Uh, but it's not even close to commercial fishing uh, in the ocean. Like not even close. Most salmon, I think, is farmed these days. It is known that Mia loves boats. I do like boats. It's super big in the Amazon rainforest. Yeah, I can Im I can imagine that being big there. Yeah, exactly. Oh my god, I'm so close to getting more people, but... What time is it? It's 9.30. I might do a short break. Would people be okay with that? If I if I put the game on... If I save the game and just put it on like a slow speed and... Because I, I need to go to the store before it closes. <laughs> but I want to keep playing. If I go for a short break and just let the game just keep going very slowly... Uh, I can go and just get some groceries and I'll be back in like 10 minutes. Not right now, like in a, in a, in a, in a, like a little bit, but I, I do need to do it. Otherwise I, otherwise I have to go to the like weird kiosk place and, um, and I, I don't like going to the weird kiosk place. Okay. Let's add some stories. No, not up there. Holy shit. Are you kidding me? No. So, this can be residential. I'm fine with that. We could have. Let's have some shops like here. And then this. And the rest of this can just be shops. This can be residential. Uh, let's hold off with making anything there, and then more residential zones. How much money do I need for the market? Fifteen thousand dollars. That's that's okay. I want to sell this fish. I want to sell this fish. Uh, let's delete the walking path and connect that up to sort of this area. So fish can just go straight to the market, but also be exported without having to go through the city itself. <laughs> and we can add that. Does that connect? It kind of connects, and then people can walk the rest of the way on the main road. Mm, I don't like how that looks. What's connected to the corner there? Yeah, that looks a lot better, in my opinion. In my onion. Cool. Hey, thank you, Hazard Storm, for subbing with Prime. Thank you. 
Speaking of speaking of which, oh my god, I'm running out of power. Ah, loans, 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 loans. I need. Let's. Okay, well, we're okay. We have we have in we have some stuff up here now. So let's. Cool. Um, we have healthcare capacity. We have water. We have electricity mostly. Crime rate is sort of low. High school is fine. I need to build more parks, but that's okay. Let's build another one of these, and then I'm gonna save the game. I'm going to the store. Save. I'm gonna wait until until I cross over because I just need 20 more people, and I think I can get that from from some of these new urban developments. And if I get that, it'll be great. Can you go sleep? Let's fan art on Twitter. Hell yeah, I love fan art. Fuck yeah. I'll check that. Boomtown. We're Boomtown. Cool. Um, sick. We're here. I'm going to, So what I'm going to do... Is I'm going to leave this game running... Uh, for like... For like a little bit. Hang on. How do I... I, yeah, I can set that up while I do this. So I'm going to go to the store <laughs> before it closes. I'll be super quick. Uh, and I should have thought of this before I made, before I started streaming. But I didn't need that. And the game, the game will keep going. It'll still be on stream, so you can still watch it if you want to. Um, uh, and uh, I'll, I'll be back and I'll continue. So like, this will, this, will, this will be a short break for all of us. So I'm going to do this. And then I'm going to do that. Hey, <laughs> you can see me. I'm going to deactivate my microphone. And uh, I'll, I'll see you all in like five to ten minutes. Uh, and, uh, you know, ho hopefully there will be someone watching by then.
<sighs> Hello. <laughs> I have returned. So let's keep playing. That worked out extremely well. I oh god, I forgot a cemetery. Holy shit. Uh very quick. Listen, when I shop, I, I shop quick. Also, I live... Uh, I shouldn't say this, because people will find out where I live. <laughs> um, I live basically on top of a grocery store. <laughs> so I, I can just leave my apartment, get what I need, and get it right back. And like, I don't need to go anywhere. It's great. I have a need for, for people. <laughs> Holy shit, what is this? Fish factory? Oh, they can fish. Okay, well... Let's primarily sell fresh fish on the market. That is what I wanted to do. Oh my god, I hate See, I don't like this. I mean, I, I know places like this actually exist. I, my hometown has a lot of places like this where it just kind of collapses in and then it's just a building, but it looks so bad. It looks awful. Um, but, you know, you, 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 play the card, you, keep, you play the cards you've been dealt. And hey, look at this. I think our... City, our normal uh, modern city center is actually kicking in. Because now we can have yakisoba tasty noodles. Perfect. So let's play some bit games. I'm also going to eat some of the snacks that I got because I, I got hungry. Mm, first, first, we should uh, build our our um our zone of transit which is basically that we may need to renovate the park a little bit to make sure that like the few in the future things will flow better with traffic but you know what uh that's okay that's fine and uh, we're gonna do like so. This is this is going to be our transit center. People will come in here. Uh, there will be a train station here, a train station, not an end station or anything like that. No disturbing the rock. We won't. We won't touch the rock. The rock is sacred. <laughs> uh, oh my God! There's a rock here too. Oh no! We can't touch that rock. That rock is also sacred. I'm gonna try to avoid rocks as much as as much as I can. I probably killed some rocks before, but that's the present progress. Um But yeah, this is where I'm gonna have like most transit things if I can make it. Because most people can walk here. Like the walking distance in this game is like wild. Like and especially when you start encouraging bikes and stuff. Like people will bike from here to like over here because, you know, it's a realistic biking distance actually. Um, yes, but I can buy another zone. Do we want to buy another zone? I kind of want to build like I kind of want to buy another zone like start building small villages around But first let's connect this up. Let's buy a national road and we're gonna buy that national road I mean it would make more sense to like build it here and connect it over here But I don't um, it would. Yeah, it would. Let's have this be the, be the inflow area of this, of this area. Um, let's do like that. Just a little, just a little road. Cool. We have electricity thanks to our wind power. That might actually be all we need. And then we can just fill in the rest of it. So perfect. And then we are also going to designate this as a farming place, because I'm going to build industry here. Um But it's going to be farming industry, which is less pollutive, less noisy, 
less profitable, yes. However, uh, it's actually not that bad. No, God, no, 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 no. Don't disturb the rock. Don't disturb the rock. We don't touch the rock. We don't touch the rock. The rock blesses us. Oh, God, I started another cult, haven't I? Fuck. I always start cults in these games. And of course you build in a place where there's no power. Please, just one more building. I'll fix it later. And we can expand this like slightly later. And people are going, going to commute here too to like work at the farms, most likely. What I could do is I could also build a like an industrial area, but I feel like that's more end game stuff. Later. The rock. Oh, music is too loud. Oh, right. I f thank you. Thank you. I f I forgot to um, to to change that when I got back. Thank you for letting me know about that. I'm gonna eat some of the snacks that I can have. So about five blocks. Yeah. Sorry. Hmm. If rock isn't the most important religion in town, we could build some sort of rock Vatican. Yes! We need to build a, a sacred park somewhere. With the grand holy rocks. It wants, it wants me to build elder care so bad, but I don't want to. Like, healthcare's fine, right? Average health 63. Average lifespan. Okay, it could be better. Well. Fine. You know, here in center town, there were there was no there was no buildings there, so may as well. It's a nice elder care. Is this working? Are we selling fish? No, we're not. Or maybe we are, but we're just selling like too much and it just doesn't show up. Let's build a post office. I'm gonna build that here. It is slightly noisy, but I also want it to be close to transit. Because I feel like that, I don't know, I feel like that's appropriate. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I like that. I'm gonna eat some more bags. I'm, I'm hungry. Let's, um, I just want to fit more people in this like little village. Cause I think it's nice. I, I want to give it its own utilities later. It might not be able to afford it, but it also like it's not gonna be covered by things up here. But what I might do, I might have some extra utility buildings like close to the transit transit center. And that might cover that too. Once we get helicopters, this will not be a problem either. Make it walkable in public transport heavy, please. Oh, you know it. I can't. We can have trams. Tram, 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 tram. Okay, what policies can we encourage? Mm, prefer parks? No, it doesn't really do much. Park and recreation, there we go. Makes the parks better. Let's distribute some smoke detectors. Mm, we 
have recycling already. We don't need to do like we we take care of our city's recycling for them. They don't need to do that. I may need to build a a dump truck, like a landfill for just temporarily, because our our garbage processing capacity isn't huge. We only have access to the very very basic sort of uh, recycling facility. Okay. Well, they're not really craving industry right now, so I guess they're fine. But I kind of okay. Let's let's also connect it a bit to the to the highway. I'm losing money. Well, fine. Fuck the smoke detectors then. Damn. Let's increase taxes on people by one percent again. There we go. Okay. Guess people have to buy their own smoke detectors. I love a tram. I love trams. I'm gonna I'm gonna connect everything up to trams, just so you know. I hope you're liking this like a little more casual. Just chill hang. I know I do. This could be little houses. Beautiful. And those can be little shops. I really like this like little fish market idea. It just sucks that no one's using it. I think I might have to build more like fishing areas so it, like we actually produce more fish. But I guess the most of the fishing is gonna have to be in the ocean and this fish market like is like hella down downtown. Although, you know what? We could build another um, like fishery down here because I feel like that that that's like on brand with the sort of like farming community, like a little fishing village. You know, produce more salmon. And the fish trucks aren't that super heavy industry either. Like they're they're fairly small because they're just like little refrigerated assholes. Primarily, we just need more people to f to fill all the workplaces. As always. What about, maybe we covered this entire area in like some sort of suburban sprawl. What happens if I do this? So it's perfect, perfect four squares. Let's, let's reduce the comfort for the rich assholes. Like a little bit and just add more folks generally for now. Let's add houses on the sides and just have it a bit closer. Their, their hilltop isolation will be no more. Well, it'll still be because they were still on the top, but still. Cool. I like this. The future train. I know, but we can demolish some things later. Maybe the train can go around. Eleven percent tax is a golden number. Yeah, if you put twelve, they start leaving. <laughs> Meanwhile, I pay like fucking fifty percent tax in socialist ass Sweden. Taking half my fucking money. And what sucks too? What sucks so fucking bad with the Swedish tax system and being a YouTuber? Is that like normally when you have a job, right? You get paid, and the taxes is almost always already deducted from your paycheck. But you get the money, and the money that you have in your account then is like almost entirely yours, bar, bar some discrepancy when it comes to tax, right? At least in Sweden, I don't know how it is in America. Um, but I get, but I get paid from Patreon, <laughs> and from YouTube, and like Twitch. Uh, and they don't, they obviously don't like pay 
tax because they're not my employer. I'm my own employer, which means I get all of the money and then I have to take that money that I already have in my bank account. And I have to claw it from myself and give it to the tax man willingly. And I hate it because then I can see how much money I have. And then I can see in real time how much I have to give away. I hate it. Can we please have some fucking farms, please? I guess the need for industry is like low because they all work over here, but still. Okay, we're expanding, we're expanding slowly but surely. How is traffic? Mm, here, uh, the, indus the industry traffic is a bit, but we can fix that. Because we have something called small heavy roads, which means that we can have four lanes. Uh, on something that is the same size as a small road. It just means that everything is a bit tighter. Which I think makes sense for an industrial area. Mm, this is a this is a this is traffic manager president edition, which is a mod that lets you do like stuff more with traffic. So I just want to see if I have any traffic lights that I need to get rid of. And I don't, apparently. The game has been very good at, with not giving me traffic lights. Traffic lights are bad, are good uh, in many situations, but a lot of times they do clog up traffic more than they help solve it. Especially in this game, which isn't perfect. Oh, I also have a mod that makes people shitty drivers. <laughs> but, but for... Um, what's it called? Um, for purposes of realism, <laughs> that means that sometimes drivers will cause accidents, which just make them stop in traffic for a few seconds, which can cause slower traffic, which is how actual traffic is. People aren't perfect drivers, people aren't computers. So I have, I have a mod that makes the traffic worse, so I have to plan around it. And that combined with the mod that makes high density people buildings actually be high density makes it so traffic is a nightmare in late game which mean which means that you need you crave transit good transit public transportation uh let's have a taxi depot again here in the in, in the sort of this area let's um no we should start having some buses maybe should we start with buses or tram tram is good for like longer distance but buses are cheaper and buses can go anywhere. You can make trolley buses later, and but I don't really know what you, what, what, why you would use one over the other. I guess trolley buses can use electricity and are better for the environment than buses, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know that much about trolley buses. If I'm completely fucking honest. Oh, we can expand Big Rock Park. We can't do a lot with it, because it's a very small space, but we can do a little bit. Let's add a little thing. And that makes it eligible for level 3, which is always good. Okay. Mm New Mia Mulder, what? I don't know what that means. Played this game a lot when I was a young chap. Never got past midway. How do you, how do you see this guy? Listen, I don't know. I'm I'm flying by the seat of my pants. I mean, mods you liked in Crusader Kings 2 that I hope to see in Crusader Kings 3. Yeah, after the end. Uh, I'd love to see after the end. But after the end is a post-apocalyptic mod uh, set in America. Where... Um, uh, base, where basically humanity got nuked back into the feudal age. Uh, and it's, it's ha it has some very interesting ideas, and I'd love to see that again. I think the Mongols are a place with uh, the British. Like, the British have, uh, like, re reconstituted themselves after the nuclear holocaust and decided to... You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna reconquer America. Why not? Um, okay, I'm a bit lost. What am I, what am I supposed to do? Everyone's fine. Mostly. City attraction is pretty good. Let's buy another tile and make another village somewhere. But let's wait until daytime so I can actually see what everything looks like. Uh, at least cops go here. Oh, what? Um, excuse me? I saw I saw a police car just drive through someone's home. Okay. Whatever. That's fine. That's 
fine, I guess. That's fine. That's fine. Whatever. I feel like I need to defund the police. What are they complaining about? Not enough customers. Well, I'm working on it. Damn. If they want more customers, they can move in here. Like, it's not that hard. Oh no, the rich asshole zone is infecting normal people. That's okay. I think I'm going, I think I am actually going to sort of connect this a little bit. Rich asshole territory is still like its own thing up here, but it's still gonna have a bit of overlap with the regular town. I just feel like I need more people generally. This is a problem we will not have once we unlock high density. Okay, it's daytime. Where should we build our next village? Can I do oil? I cannot. I can't yet. I need 5,000 people to do an oil industry, and that's oil over here, so that's... Let's do... We could do a little village over here, like a little fishing village. No, the river is too small, I think. Maybe something over here? That could be nice. It's close to the waterfall, though. We could make something something up here, too. Like a completely different town, almost. Oh, oh. You made an EU, EU4 mod? What mod? T tell me the mod and I'll, I'll, I'll maybe I'll try it. <laughs> that is your whole thing. Can you, can you build a forest park? I can. The forest park is going to become the holy, the holy site and we're going to name it as such. And it will only be surrounded by like good buildings and parks and uh, stuff like that. And it will only be accessible by tram. Uh, to protect the holy rocks from cars or I don't know train or airplane or whatever ferry <clears throat> I'm just thinking about how we should do transit how I should expand my town. I'm a little bit confused. I'm thinking maybe I maybe I expand up like this and like really like I really expand the suburban area. This will still work because as long as the this like area is is free, I can I can kind of fuck around with that because I kind of want the outflow of traffic to be here either under the river or over it depending on what I decide to do. I might have like a big train station here, for example. And again, this is gonna this is going to be mostly high density anyway, so like, it's fine to have like tran like big transit here that doesn't really go anywhere else. It doesn't have to be in the center. Mm. I'm gonna try doing this. I can all I have to remind myself that if something goes wrong, I can always like uh, renovate entire districts. Like no one is forcing me to like pick a style and stay with it forever let's expand rich asshole territory just a little bit uh do they have water not all of them oh that became a bit misaligned but that's okay people people move into my town this should be... This should... I, oh, well, I can renovate that later, too. That's fine. I don't have to stick with anything. The traffic is going fairly well. Because, as you can see, because these only have, like, one or two households in them, there's, like, almost no traffic. Because there's only going to be, like, one car per household. And that car is either going to be at work or at home most of the time. And most of the time, people just walk anyway. So, this might look like a lot, but it's actually, like, very little because it's it's the, the vanilla is four i think and so this is like four times less traffic intensive. that's great hydrate me a little bit yes yes that's me that's me my public transit i don't have any tra public transit 
yet. Oh, thank you, Comet Leader, uh, for subbing. Thank you very much. For four months, damn, I need to start doing, like, um, rewards for long-term patrons. Uh, for long-term subbers. Still don't fully know how, how Twitch works, so I, I apologize for that, but I'm, I'm working on it. Let's maybe do a child... Childcare, yeah, why not? Right next to the the place. They match, this is perfect, I like this. They do look a bit more rural, but I think that's fine for now. We may move them later. If, if push comes to shove, you know? The park is doing okay. I'm thinking, okay, where, okay. I'm thinking up here. Do you see this area over here? I think this should be our rock sanctuary. So I'm going to start buying my way over there. Like, look at this, because it, it's on a bit of a mesa itself, so all the rocks will become even higher up than anything else. And that's where Big Rock Park is going to be. It's called Galicia. Hang on, let me let me save that. Galicia, save. Uh, and I'm just gonna telegram that to myself. EU4 mod. Uh, and I'll look into it. I, I haven't played EU4 on stream either, so that might be fun to do someday. Still no industry. Like, this little patch of industry is like providing all of the industrial needs for the entire town, apparently. Okay, we're getting more people. We're getting more people. Let's. I have a chair, I have a chair. King of the castle. Hmm, electricity is going down slightly. And this isn't too, this isn't water enough to make it like worth having stuff. So we can just expand this uh, like wind park up there. That's fine, it's perfect. What sort of industry do I have? I Right now I only have generic industry and I have a lot of farming industry over here. Again, I only have a population of 3,000, so I haven't really... We're still starting in. I'm very jealous of my hair. You shouldn't be. It's a, it's a rat's nest most of the time. It's, it's a pretty good. Maybe Civilization 6? Maybe. I'm not a huge fan of the Civilization series. I, I, don't, I don't find it to work the way I want it to work a lot of the time. Offices are superior. Offices are definitely superior, yeah. Once, you, uh, once used in school, a Civilopedia article for history class. Wow, did that work? It annoys me how brown the land is, yeah. Metro series? I might play Metro series. I did a, I tried to doing a re replay of Metro 2033, like on my own time a while ago. I, and I didn't, like I'll be honest, I didn't love it. Uh, well, I did, but I never, like it didn't hook me so deep with that, to the point where I finished it. Like I, like I didn't. So I feel like if I ever, if, if I ever did like a replay of it, I would need like, I would need some sort of time to, like, get back into it a little bit. Let's make this, like, village a bit bigger. But I, the industry need is starting up now, which I'm happy about. Okay, I'm considering, I'm considering starting with buses. Just to have them, because they're good to have. And to connect these two like areas a little bit and to like uh, go around the suburban districts especially up here and like take them downtown into this sort of transit area uh, maybe drop them off by the library or something something like that because it would be very center of town and i don't think a tram can sort of get there but i'm thinking like a tram can eventually go like from here 
to like that can go up here to the holy area that the tram can go down here the tram like the tram will be a sort of like mini mini train because that's what a tram is uh, and like stop people along the way frequently as a tram is wont to do and then maybe if we can like widen some of these roads we can use a tram like in the middle of town because the benefit of having a tram is that it doesn't take up traffic if it's on a medium road like it has its own lane and can just go unimpeded in very dense areas so it's very good to have a sort of like as a connector but it's also good to have in a very very dense area but I, i'll need to upgrade some roads to make that work but i can't do that and hopefully we will We're making a good amount of money, so that's good. And we're getting some farming! At last! Look at this, beautiful. We're getting a little bit of farming. Maybe we should connect this, this, like, these highways up a little bit. We don't have to do a super fancy thing, we can just, like... We can just, like, make a little thing, you know? Like, let's make... Like an off ramp uh, and a sort of like something like that. Oh, that's that's well, that's horrendous. But you know what I mean. Like so, like people can like turn off and get in there, and people can like drive out that way. If people are on this highway, they're fucked. <laughs> no, I'll I'll make something work for them too. Um, would this work? <laughs> and then a similar thing sort of here where they... They can get it. Oh my god, that's so ugly. Oh my god. It's better. Oh my god, it's such a spindly mess. But you know, it does it does the job. Can't complain about that. I'm doing this primarily so that agricultural exports can like leave the city. And it also might like offload a bit of traffic up here too, because right now if, if someone has to, if someone wants to go here from the highway, like if they're on the highway here, they have to go like all the way through this town. Now they can just kind of go through the highway and just drop off. It's not perfect. It's ugly, but yeah. How am I doing? I'm doing great. Encourage bicycling and cycling. Yes, uh, I I want to do that, but I don't think I can do that yet. No, I don't have city planning unlocked yet. I have a very small population for now. Oh, I need commercial districts? Really? We can do that. I need more people in my town. I hate doing this. Like it but you know, houses got to go somewhere and I can't afford to do much of anything right now. However, um you know, it is a, it is a video's game, which means I can I can demolish this without much remorse later, and it'll be fine. If I need to, is all I'm saying. I don't think I will. Like I'm, I think this looks mostly fine actually. We just need to add. We just what we need. What we do need is we need to add some public transport 
in this like suburban area because it's very big like someone who lives here is almost definitely gonna take a car to go wherever they're going and if they don't have a car they're gonna fucked so what we need to do is like maybe have some sort of like bus line that like goes uh, around the outskirts and just kind of collects them into the middle and then if we have a tram that like goes more central and like goes to more like outlying locations that, that the bus can't reach they can like transfer that's one thing i love in this game by the way that people will take like bus stop the neighbor's corner shops yes what a great idea let's do that uh let's expand rich asshole heights um just little corner shops you know Ding, 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 ding. I love that. I love that. We can also... Like, I think this works. Let, let's add... Let's, let's make it even better. Let's do it like this. So they have like a little, little, like a little corner. Let's, actually, let's just make the whole corner a little, little shopping, a little shopping thing. A little decentralized, because um, you know, big shopping district is is good to have too, but especially when you have the um, the perk that I have, whatever it's called, the um, this organic and local produce, uh, they don't really produce that much traffic. So yeah, so now like pe now people who are here, they'll still be equally far, but they're like people who live here. They don't have to like travel all the way into the center of town. Like they can like go to the little corner shop. What a grand idea! Displacing doesn't appeal to expand the city, but it's a lot because I'm older. Gigantic multiple downtown. It's no way near the city center. Damn. How's the temperature or production? We're doing fine. We're doing not super great on sewage treatment, but that's okay. We can simply build another sewage treatment plant. Don't worry, we are going to make clean water when we can. Like we're gonna make clean and drinkable water. Like we're not we're gonna reduce pollution so much if we can. Everyone's just getting so hype about fishing. We already had fishing. Come down. Okay, this doesn't seem to have caused like a massive flow in traffic. This box truck is drove halfway across town to save like a minute of time, but okay. I can fix that later by banning heavy traffic on this road. So the heavy traffic has to use the the highway system, but like no, normal people in cars and like small small delivery trucks can can drive there. Actually, let's um. No, I th I think I think Flat Rock Farms, like the farming area, I think that n n has to have heavy traffic. I'm not super sure how the heavy traffic ban works actually, so don't don't quote me on anything. How many people do we have? We're halfway through to. Slightly over halfway to 7,000, and everything's going well, so we can expand quick, is what I'm hoping. So let's lower tax a little bit, so people move in. How are we doing with loans? Can we repay loans? Yes, let's repay a loan. No debt here, no siree. Uh, and this area doesn't have any parks, so let's fix that, shall we? Oh, actually, um... Uh, ba -ba 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 because this is a because this is most likely going to be the smallest town. Pump that by the highway ramp. No, that sucks. Look at this. A little asteroid too. They can they can have the asteroid. A meteor? Meteorite. They can have a little meteorite. It's still flat rock farms, but they can have the meteorite as a sort of reward. 
we might move that too. Um, we might we might move the this thing to uh, the the holy flats up here, which is going to become one huge nature reserve to protect the holy rocks. Why do I always make cults in games? It's uh, like even the city even the city builder games I just make cults. In Frostpunk, I made a soup cult. I guess that's just who I am. Oh, we need more elementary schools, like, badly. <laughs> Yeesh. Let's build, like, local elementary schools. People love that shit. <laughs> local elementary schools, people love that shit. Like, we're way over capacity, but I would, I would prefer small school sizes. Whoa! Whoa! Of a tsunami approaching the area. Residents should avoid roads and waterfronts. A tsunami has struck the city. Take caution and avoid roads and waterfronts until okay. the water recedes. Let's uh <laughs> What the fuck? What? What? <laughs> the rock protects. The rock protects the town! Well, most of it. Well, still. Look at that. Like, it blocked the wave from most of the town. The rock! It barely flooded anything. Holy shit. We need uh, to pump. Pump, 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 pump. Is this pump? No, there's a tank reservoir. I need a pumping station. <laughs> Where's the pumping station? I, comple I completely forgot where the pumping station is. Isn't it here? There's a water treatment plant. I, I, maybe I, I may not have unlocked it. Yeah, pumping service. I need, five th I need a thousand more people to do that. But it's already fixed! See? It didn't ruin any- it didn't ruin a single building thanks to the rock. Oh, this, oh, there's, oh, danger's not over yet, though. The wave is, uh, flowing up the river. Those power lines are gone. At, at least the stream is, like, counteracting, but there, there will be, like, like this just big ball. Uh-oh, okay, well, uh, ba -ba 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 -da 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 -da. uh, how do I, how do I fix that? <laughs> Uh, stop! Hammer time. Oh, it's too late. It's too late for them. But I have to build embankments, <laughs> apparently. God, even in even in video games, I can't escape the fact that I'm Dutch. Okay, so we might suffer a few casualties here, but the the embankment will protect us. The dike will protect us. Oh my god. We're gonna get like a moat. Oh! No! Bradley! Bradley, no! Stop going to work! Bicycle, no! Well, we have a new lake. So that's, uh, that's something. They will eventually dry away, so that's... We actually survived that tsunami, like, all pretty well. This rock, like, no joke, dissipated the entire water wave that was coming towards this town. Like, I'm... This rock saved us. Holy shit, I've never been- I, I- I know the- I know it's a meme, but like the rock. Hailed the rock. Are you- are you still flooding? Yes. Can you stop flooding, please? Oh, the boat! The boat's just riding the wave! I'm loving this. I'm loving this. Just riding the tsunami wave. <laughs> Sue for my cult. Aren't I Swedish? I am also Swedish, yes. 
I have, I contain multitudes. Oh no. Uh oh. Well, I mean, it's, I guess it's flowing away. Like it missed the, the town by most much. I just hope it doesn't like flow out over too much of the city. The fish, oh God. Oh, that's... Okay, yeah, it's not, it's not too bad, but it's not great either. Cool. The, oh, that, oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, no, the, the emergency dispatch has nothing to go on, so let's, let's fix that, too. Because apparently I, didn't, I forgot to give them a power source. Can you send a helicopter out? Thank you. God, what a game. What a fun game this is. Hydrate! Oh god. <laughs> yes. Steal Arizona's rocks, yeah. Are there survivors? I hope so. Oh my god, they even have a rescue dog! I've never seen that before! Can we click on the dog? Wait, can we click, can we click on the dog? No, we can't. We can't even click on the people. Oh my god, I've never... This is amazing. Rebuild. <laughs> and just instantly fixed. Beautiful. Fix roads? What roads do I need to fix? Oh, something here is fucky. Okay, let's um, fix that. And uh, we're all working again. Hmm. <laughs> Survived a fucking tsunami, I guess. I didn't think we would have to worry about that so far inland, but okay. We just have the blob of a lake here. We have a little lake over there. Wonderful. Well, we, we're we fine. And we actually have a lot of money now because I spent so much time fucking around with that. So that's... Um, I, I mean, uh, you know, there there is one thing we do in this game and it, it is expansive, Rubio. There's really nothing else to do. Do -do 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 the fuck is that? Mia, come on. Now. We'll add in plumbing so that they have water. It's gonna do. Oh, we're yeah, cause I I wanged it. That's okay. That's like way better. Okay. Um. Electricity, we have electricity, we have water. How's the garbage? We need another recycling plant, but that's okay. We can just build one. There's no law against that. Mm, that should be everything that they need. Let's expand the rich asshole zone a bit more. I kind of like having that sort of like rich asshole zone. Like at the edge of it, you know? Uh, let's add in more corner shop territory. And then everything else is just housing. Oh, there's crime? There's crime in rich assholeville? Oh no. Um, I mean, let's, I guess we have to add a, let's add a, let's add a little cop station. Keep an eye on rich people doing securities fraud or whatever the fuck rich people do. Mm, can we expand this embankment? Kind of like having it. Got a plan around it, I guess. I'm 
let's protect this from in the eventual in the for the eventuality of a fucking tsunami. This far inland, there's even a waterfall in the way. Like there should. Oh, I mean, I I think those are after sh shock waves or something. What I think happened was an earthquake, in um. Out here, because uh, tsunamis can happen just on their own too in the game. But what usually happens is some, that some kind of earthquake happens and then. Uh, shit's fucked. This kind of looks like not awful. Well, I mean, it looks awful, but less awful. Expand! Which each grid weirdly subdivided into cul de sacs. Yeah. Grids. How settler colonial. <laughs> I know, I want to build like European style cities too, but you can't really do that because this, I mean, by, by the very nature of the game, this is a planned city. We need to make sure less fires here, but we can add a little like thing like that. Should we have a clinic down here too, perhaps? Yeah, let's have just a small clinic. Oh, and all, oh, the houses love that. Like, upgrade, upgrade a clock. Let's build a little like park or something, because they they have so little things here out in flat rock farms, and I want to give them something. Let's give them no. Let's give them a small park. Just a, just a regular like little normal small park. I'm just lift. Yeah, look at that. Much better. Cool, cool. Again, we're, we're going to add some sort of... Well, maybe we can do that now. Maybe we can afford it. Tram Depot for $40,000. Jesus. Um, okay, but we, we can we can plan for it now, which, I, which is what I want to do. So this is a tram line, because we, we are going to have trams. Hmm... I don't think we need it on a park, but I might upgrade these ones to become tram lines. So like, downtown has small roads, but it's surrounded by like bigger roads that will like manage most of the traffic. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Um, but I'm not sure how that will work. I can expand here, but it, it we'll have to move big rock and we're not doing that. I may have to make the 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 innermost residential areas. I may have to make them into into commercial areas, or like offices or something, to make to make sure that it like works. Because I don't think people want to live right next to like the the more the most busy roads, you know. So I might just shift it a block, you know. Yeah, that could be interesting. But we can also do these, which is which we, what we can do for now, which is a two-lane road with tram tracks. But we, what you can see here, for example, um, someone told me earlier that I explained the game well, and I and I am gonna live that high until the rest of my days. As you can see, this has two lanes, like a wide road, but it also has this green lane specifically for trams, and uh, the things that can go on the tram line is emergency vehicles, which is important, and, and tramps, and that's it. But this means that traffic will be here on these big roads. So even when you're having like really bad traffic, let's say that there's a fire somewhere. The fire trucks can just go onto the tram line and share traffic with the trams, but because trams are like, they're not really gonna, they're not gonna clog up traffic that much unless you have a bunch of them. And even then it's not that bad. Uh, they can just zoom past all of the like bad traffic to go where they need to go, which means that your uh, your emergency services are like way more effective than they would be otherwise. So that's uh, that's how I'm thinking, and I can't afford to make trams, but I'm not making huge amounts of money, which I'm like a bit salty about. We're, oh, let's let's bump this up to 11 again, and we'll make more money, I think. Mm. 
Okay. What kind of mutual things can we do? We can make a multi plat multi thing plat platform, but we don't need to do that because I can't even make a train yet. Why is this? Why are these grayed out and the rest of them are black? I don't. We have a post office, nice. I like that the fish market is like a is like a big draw of, of tourists apparently. Hmm. What am I thinking? I'm 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 struggling a little bit. Office specialization. No, I don't need to do that. I can just expand normally. Um no, let's, let's keep building out tram roads, especially for the outlying districts. Because I, f I want to have, I want to have them covered by a tram if I can. Like out here. Like, and, and these roads, for example, they, they have one lane each, but they all, but they share that lane also with the tram. So they are far less affected than a wide road. But because this is a like, very rural suburbia for now at least there's so few cars here that that like that's fine like they have to share traffic but it's actually not that bad let's uh keep the tram love going and now i have to reckon what to do with uh with this i guess like okay Okay, we can make this wide road for now. Um, yeah, let's, let's just make that wide road for now. We'll we can do we can deal with the zoning changes when that comes up because I think this will just help with traffic, like as is, you know. Let's do like that too. You, that's a medical clinic. So we can move that there. I like this. Yeah, this is gonna be great. Like, yes, it, it's a bit fucky with the houses right now, but that'll be okay later. It might work even actually, cause they're, they're gonna be high density. So that might work, you know? I'm not sure how people feel about li like living next to the tram line, but I hope but, you know it might work out. Adaptability is the name of the game when it comes to games like this. And look at this. So my my idea is here's here's my idea that this is the city center, right? This area here. This is where this is where people shop. This is where people like mostly do their shopping. But then like here, when people enter town and leave town, whatever whatever they do and what it, at whichever end, they can go into the city center, or if they want to go somewhere else, they go they take the bigger road to go to go somewhere else. Which means that uh, there's less traffic in, in central town, so like traffic is split between between people who want to go somewhere else in town and people who just want to go into the central town immediately. I think this can be great. I like that. I like that a lot, actually. <laughs> Why didn't runs in the transit with use? And only those can be used. Why are some streets using different color lights? So uh, it depends on the type of road that you're using. So the small, these ones use a very bright light. Uh, the, these ones use a more yellowish light. And then the, and then the like very high density use a very, very bright light. Like it's almost overpowering. How are our lines doing? 
Oh, gazebo. Okay, so this is how... This is how the tram line is looking right now. Which isn't really connecting anything to anything. So my idea is what I'm going to do is... But again, like, again, we're, we're, we're starting, we're, we're starting slow. So here's my first idea. My first idea is to have a sort of, no, um, can I just show that please? Thank you. So transit area, one tram that just goes around here, another tram that goes around here too. So they, so they it's a clockwise and counterclockwise setting. Uh, to take people like just around the town wherever they want to go like maybe someone's here they want to go up here maybe someone's down here they want to go here whatever I don't care um, but they also stop here in, the, in this in the in the transit area for people who want to take like a bus somewhere or maybe they want to transfer somewhere else they go here this is like the this is central town for transport there's another tram line that's gonna go like here around like so Maybe another one that also goes clockwise. I'm not super sure about that. Uh, and they also stay here, which means my idea is that like someone can take the tram from up here. They can take the tram down here. They can change and take the tram up here. So they, so they never have to use a car. That's my plan. I think that I think that's a great plan in, in all honestly, uh, honest, honesty. But we need a we need a point to introduce them to the tram line, which is why I'm going to build a depot. Once I get the money to do it. Yeah, okay, so let's let's just vibe and get some money. Traffic isn't really a big problem right now, but again, we're just also, I'm saying again, over and over again, I'm so sorry. What the sh- oh my god, this looks horrendous. Ugh. The middle of the block. That's true. Like I could just have them. Another friend could run the, uh, the trans offset from the road grid, running through the middle of the block. Yeah, uh, like you know, just through just through them. I could do that, but I'm. That's also kind of where I'm hoping to do other sorts of things, like uh, potentially either a train might be a bit light. Or a monorail. Either way, like even if I do end up doing trams like into the sort of grid system here, um, there is a good reason to have this sort of square system that I like doing. My population is increasing, as is my money. Let's get some trams. Let's get some trams, motherfucker! Yes. Let's start with a very basic line. Uh, stop here. Stop there. A stop here. And come back. We can always add more, more lines to these later. And one that goes counterclockwise. Cool. Now I'm going to customize them. I don't have a lot of mods like change the model of the tram, so you'll have to you'll have to do with color coding. They are blue. Both of them are blue. So downtown A downtown A downtown. B. Now I'm going to have a little bit of snack. And we can watch our town. Actually, can I watch the town? Well, this could be interesting. While, while I enjoy a snack, I'm also going to enjoy this Julmust, which is a Swedish Christmas drink. Oh, dab, fuck. Dab. Dab, dab, dab. 
Oh my god, you can see, you can see the piles of pu the pumes of smoke from the industrial area. Yeesh. Okay, let's. Can I zoom out? Yeah, let's just do a let's just do a normal follow. That'll be more fun. Elevator cycleways. Yeah, like there's. I have so many options for things to do. I'm definitely gonna add in more cycle. Um, um, cycleways for people to take their bike. I don't know why you wouldn't put like a walking path though. Like you can't. There's some, there's a difference between using a walking path and using a cycle path. But they, they can also bike on the on the walking path. So it's just that people aren't allowed to walk on the cycle on the cycling path. But I don't know why people wouldn't do that. The tram bell was almost perfectly timed that it died, but nice. Okay. Let's add more commercial stuff here for now. I can always demolish it. Let's also expand downtown while I'm at it. I'm just gonna do like that. It's one big long. Perfect. Maybe I'll demolish these roads and expand Big Rock Park. That could be something. Let's build a gazebo in the Big Rock Park. There's a few gazebos around the old Big Chungus. Just gonna add more so I can fulfill their entertainment requirements. Cool. People love gazebos, what can I say? Yo, oh my god, look look at the impact this is having too. Just the size uh, of the of the park's influence. I'm also gonna get a, a park maintenance building, probably smack that up here too. Uh, because it makes all park buildings more effective. Which in turn makes people happier, which in turn makes them pay more taxes. Bus lanes are also bike lanes. Yeah, I think they bike on bus lanes. I don't think they're supposed to, but I think they do it anyway. How's Flat Rock Farms doing? They seem to be good. The population of 700 in Flat Rock Farms. Damn, good job. Does anyone live in downtown? Yeah, some houses are covered. I'm very happy to have seen like that there's not too much traffic into Flat Rock Farms. Like there there is traffic because of the farms. But there's not like a, a wild amount of it. Mm. I'm going to add a thing because I'm concerned about it. Just to sort of offload like cars, so heavy heavy farming can like go in here and just go out. Oh, I can afford the park maintenance building. Cool. Just built that in the hills. Oh, god, it's so ugly. Ugly. Down here then. Oh, that looks much better. And they go out to parks and just make them better. Cool. Electricity is okay-ish. Water, okay-ish. Cemetery, okay-ish. 
education. We have a lot of people who are eligible for university, but we need more people to do that. Can I buy another thing? I cannot. Not yet. How much do I need for... To become a busy town, I need 5,000 people. And then I can make oil. Sick. Mm. Let's expand. Let's expand this area a little bit. Can you guess what this is going to become? <laughs> Shit. Uh, thanks, Evil Snowball. Uh, go check out, go check out Evil Snowball. Hello, raiders. I am Mia Mulder. Uh, I am a lefty YouTuber who is right now building a very capitalist society. <laughs> Let's have a little, like. A little shop. Let's have a little shop street. Yeah. Like some small shops. And then the rest can be houses. Yeah. Cute. What a nice town. It's a shame that things get dug into the hill rather than being built with one side taller than the other. Yeah, I wish that, like, I wish buildings could be slanted. <laughs> I mean, I know they can't, because for realism reasons. For realism, it's actually better for it to do it like that. It just feels weird, you know? Oh, look at this farming, though. It's actually time for me to, to do, like, proper... We need to we need to utilize the farming space. So A little farming hexagon thing. God, I, I love this game so much. City needs more power. Excuse me. Oh God. Oh, and I almost have no money to do it. Come on now. Do you have any other clean energy things coming? No. Ocean thermal energy conversion plant. What? I've never seen that before. Hey, I'm a busy town. I can have a trolley bus. I can have tourism. Forget about it. <laughs> but that makes noise, right? They make a lot of noise. Causes noise pollution. Yeah, exactly. So I can't have that close to where people live. People don't want to live close to tourist touristy areas. The next step is seven and a half, right? Yeah. But once we get seven and a half, we can do high density shit. And then our suburban suburbia nightmare will be over. Oh god, I've been playing for two hours and forty minutes. I'm gonna play at least until high density. At least. And then we'll raid someone. Stringy bus!
So the inside flat. Yeah, you know that that does make sense. That is how that is how you can do buildings. I think it just becomes like I don't know how people do buildings. I'm not an architecture nerd. I might guest on um, on, a, on, a, on a disaster podcast, but I, I, that doesn't mean I know anything about anything. Mm. There are people waiting at the stops, though. So you know, there. Oh my God! Look at this. Speaking of which, let's add a. Oh, that just broke everything, did it? Oh God! Oh God! What have I done? <laughs> Trolley bus into space. Oh, it's fine. <laughs> Oh no, I broke it a little bit. Uh, let's, let me move this. So it like resets. There we go. Looks a bit better. <laughs> Fly away, tram! Be free! <sighs> I guess I have to lower taxes again. It's low, it's nine. It's gonna most likely wreak havoc on my economy. I guess also maybe people don't want to live over here because they don't have a lot of services. I don't even think they have a school here. Let's, so let's maybe give them one. How's high school doing? It's actually kind of filling up, which is a good problem to have. So let's build another high school here. And how are we doing in terms of parks? We can add a tennis court or something to the rich people areas. The reason why I want to make things pretty for them is so that they can upgrade their houses. Because they can't do that otherwise. Uh, and if they don't do that, then they would just become a bit like... Like stunted in their like housing development. And you don't want that. So you can see all these green arrows now, and all of them are like re-renovating. That's because the housing, uh, the land value has gone up dramatically, which means they have to pay more tax. Uh, but that also means that the, the building is like upgraded. Which for some small buildings like this, especially with the mod, means that they just pay more tax. I think they become like more educated, like they, you know, they become richer basically. Uh, it's I'm gentrifying this area. <laughs> But when it comes to big buildings, what that means is the building will become bigger. So high density apartments, for example, will become really high density. Uh, so I think and initially, I think uh, an apartment building can have like 16 households or something like that, but that will rapidly exp like grow. Interesting. I'm learning so much. I like how the game's warning me about like, hey, you can buy a tsunami warning boy. Oh, also la higher land value also makes people more more uh, willing to move in. Let's give people the, let's give you guys like a tennis court or something also. The next next to the school so they can do PE. Yeah, that's good. Let's do that. Like they can play tennis and they can play Basketball, yeah. Okay, so they are they are expanding up here too. A little bit. Five and a half thousand. I need, yeah, I need to sort of build, like, you know what? Let's, let's just, let's just bite, a Swedish saying, let's just bite the sour apple and just do it. Just like expand another row. I don't want to do it, but you know, sometimes we do things we don't want to do. 
that loan. No, your corner shop area. Here, you can buy such luxurious things as <laughs> housing. <laughs> or, oh my god, look at that, it's beautiful. Like, you can like go up in the roof. It's nice. You can buy organic teas. Or an Edison shop, where you can buy an Edison. An electric car. Because everything has, has a Tesla in it now. It's still close enough to the um, to the tram, which I'm happy about. Did I add stops here, by the way? I have not. I didn't do that. I forgot to do that. Let's add that. Here, so it's still on the same line, but we're not gonna we're not gonna do dupe we're not gonna do like a duplicate. I think one tram line might be enough. No, let's do a duplicate. Like they don't overlap anywhere. Well, here we'll stop here, and then it's just all the way back because that's not really what you yeah the. This one takes you to the to the center of town. It doesn't take you it it takes you to the tram to the transit station, but it doesn't take you to Yeah, it, it's not supposed to take you into into like the downtown shops area. That's a different tram that does that. Let's do like so. Um suburb suburban line a suburban line B. Look at that. And you are going to be green. Perfect. Um, so we're going to keep expanding our suburban hive cluster. Then I'm not sure. This might actually be enough to sort of propel us to seven and a half. I mean, it, it, it's not going to on its own. Like, we're going to have to build, like, another farming village. I really like this little village we built, though. I think that's so cool. I think, I think, I think this actually works very well together. I'm so happy I got the game to work. I'm so happy we got the way to work. Neoliberal <laughs> me. Well, I was a tanky when I played Tropico. And became a totalitarian state, so. Um, let's see, I don't want too many cars on the suburban line. Eight vehicles? We don't need that at all. We can reduce that to four. Um, because this is a suburban line, like, we don't need a lot of traffic. Like, some of them are picking up a lot of people, but, like, because, like, that's just because it's the very first one. Uh, we may have to up the, up the count to that a bit later, but we don't need eight trams running around like this. It's just because the distance is big, it's not because the traffic is actually that big. Like, four will be f well enough. It's a suburban line. Like it, it comes, it comes like once every half hour. It doesn't have to come every ten minutes, or how, however often that would be. I don't even know what that would translate to. So we've done that. They're they're still expanding industry in various locations. You know what we can do? I know what we can do. I know exactly what we can do.
Um, oh no, I fucked up. No. How's this? Come back. National Road can go from here to there, and then this tram road, which only carries trams by the way, can connect to the rest of the tram network like that. And then we can have a... Actually, let's, let's move this up here so that they don't overlap too much. And then we can have a tram line that goes from here, from there, to here, and back again. Just to sort of connect these areas. We can expand this later too. And this is the... Oh god, I almost spilled on my coke. Ah! Flat rock. Express. And you will be red. What's the budget on that? Five vehicles? No, you can also be down to four. We don't need we don't need too many. Melon husk. <laughs> no traps all day, then eight come in ones. Tram, tram, tram. I fucking love trams. Like, I love them. Look, and look at this. It's all, oh my god. Oh yeah, that's just because I've changed the road setup a little bit. Yeah, maybe changing that into the middle of the road wasn't the best idea in the world. Uh, let's, let's fix that actually. <laughs> like, maybe it should go down, like, from here. Uh, yeah, I think that's way better. Like that, I think that'll flow infinitesimally better. And let's remove traffic lights there, there, and there. We don't need that. We don't need traffic lights there and there either, nor there, nor there, nor there, nor there, nor there, nor there. Nor there. We don't need. We don't need it. We don't need traffic lights at these locations. What we do need are stop signs. Which I don't know how to add, add right now because I'm stupid. Whatever. There is a way to add stop signs. We just need to make sure that roads in here have priority and people who are coming into it have a stop sign to be like, hey, let's watch. This corner. Yeah, it's uh, it, it just looks a bit interesting, but you can see how everything connects well. <gasps> the Express. It's on its way and it has 12 passengers. That's 12 cars that are now no, no longer on the road. And look at this, wouldn't you love to take the tram here? Over this massive gorge. I think it's be I'm I think I'm speaking very loudly. <laughs> I have roommates. It's eleven PM. I should I should be more quiet. They're coming oh my god, look at the traffic. Holy shit. Is it full? 89. Holy shit. No, like, you know, people want to go to the shopping districts. And yet again, the thing I really love with the AI in this game is that um, passengers, like uh, citizens, they will 
they they know how to connect different tram lines in their own mind to know where they're supposed to go so they can like they can take a tram to to they can take a tram somewhere and then take a train somewhere and then go to their destination by foot like they, they don't have to have a direct pathway and so many video games only have like if there's not a train to this destination then i don't know where to do uh, or you have to micromanage it excessively and this game just does it for you i would love if games like workers and resources of soviet republic did something like this uh, but that game is like way too micromanaging to allow that i think oh there's a traffic light here that's not supposed to happen be gone that one goes on we turn off 89 people go off and 17 get on holy shit look at that like f just flood of of traffic some of which are going to like other lines some of people are like walking into to shopping some people are like going in elsewhere god i love this game fuck 5.7 thousand that's okay let me just look at this i love it just a little tram line that goes back and forth I'm so happy and we still have the, like the national road that like connects these two these two areas so people can drive there if they want to uh, people can take the highway here if they want to they're both very well connected how are how are my people doing my lifespan has gone down <laughs> that's not great I need to add like community pools and gym gymnasiums and shit Maybe I should have a clinic up here too. Like a local clinic for people to go to. Is our clinic down here? No. How are people living in my town? The opioid epidemic has hit my town very, very severely. Monorails? I like monorails. Come on. Settle my town, please. Okay, wait, what was this over here? This was um, oil, right? Maybe we'll make an oil industry. Here, maybe we'll make a tiny, a tiny, tiny little oil industry. Just, just, just to export stuff, you know. And people can take the highway to get here. Uh, maybe we'll like we'll add some sort of like a bus that goes here from the city center, but that's it. Um, just gonna make like a small oil field. Beautiful. Can I? <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, let's connect this to the highway, which means I have to renovate <sighs> this again. Okay, um, first of all, let's have a national road to drive into it. Uh, that goes over the train line because we're going to use that later and something like that okay let's have an off-ramp first and then just like this but also but 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 also uh, 
Um, we're going to add an off ramp here. To sort of drive into that. So they can come in here. This road is set. They can go in here. We just need a, a way for cars to get onto here. So let's go. No, 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 no. Don't judge me for my very, very poor like road skills. I, I don't know how to do that in the game. In the game. I'm bad at that. And it merges. Oh, no. No, 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 no. That won't work at all. Holy shit. Mm, okay. I'm just gonna do a tunnel. Cool. I'm thinking I'm just I'm just gonna make this while I wait for the um, for people to like move into my into my things because I like you know I have a lot of zones up here and they just have to move into them. A reaction fairies? I don't know what a reaction fairy is. Can I change the street lights? No, I can't, and I hate it. Oil egg. The oil egg. <laughs> Oh, I need to build a specialization thing. Uh, can I take a loan for that? No, I can't because I only took Cosmos. Okay. Let's wait until we have some money so this can actually become a, a zone. The oil egg. Um, are we going to bless the oil egg? Is the question. Let's bless the oil egg with a hole. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I know, yeah, I know. Reaction fairies. Oh my god, yeah, yeah. Um, they use a sort of like, like string on a string, like a rope and like an angled wheel, sort of like an like an angled um, rudder. So they just like go along the stream, like 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 so. Appa and apparently they're very effective. I saw a Tom Scott video about it. <laughs> they're really, they're really good. I wish you could have them like in the game in some sort. Um, I, I know that they exist on the on the Danube River, but I don't really know where, where else they exist, if at all, honestly. I mean, they, I'm sure that they do, I just don't, I, I'm... Once again, I am stupid. We have an oil field. Hell yes. But let's electrify this oil field, first of all. Um... I don't have enough money. Come on now. There we go. What 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 were we going to call this again? I forgot. We had uh, we had a good name for this. Egg egg. Egg. Now we have to build some extraction things, but that's okay. Um, but yeah, I am considering maybe making a biofuel like bus depot thing and making it so that there's a, a bus like going from 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 the center of town to to here, so that people can like commute to work. Because right now it's a bit rough. I'm not sure how people would actually do it. Can people? Oh, they can. Look at that. Like people can go here. They can off the off ramp. On the highway and then immediately off the highway, just go in again. Uh, can they go back? Can they come back though? <laughs> no, they can't. So 
so they can go into town, but they have a hard time coming back out of it. So let's we can well we can fix that too. We're seeing a small highway ramp again, uh, I suppose. Because they can come easily into this area, but they have a hard time getting out of it. So. I think this is a, a job for Tunnel Boy. It's a bit of a mess, but you know what? Shut up. But at least this way, like, commuters can go back and forth, but also uh, there can be, like, exports and exports from this, because this is going to produce a lot of, like, fuel tanks, and I don't want that to go into the cities. So I think, you know what, you know what, it works. Egg, 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 egg. This one over the Rhine? Yeah, that makes sense. Like really big rivers that have like a constant powerful flow. I feel like those work. Cause like I have a river in my town, but like you don't really need a ferry. Uh, like I think, I think they can only be used in like very specific conditions, but when they work, they work. Okay, let's produce oil. Egg. All right, I was supposed to build a, a, a bus. Well, you know, they need somewhere to go first, so. Where's this farm truck importing to juice press, what? Right? The fuck, you're in a farming area. The idea is that you're supposed, you're not supposed to import stuff. Yeah. But actually, that's okay. I'm, I actually kind of want to make a... Um, a heavy traffic ban. I want to avoid heavy, tra heavy traffic moving on these two bridges. At least on the, at least on this main bridge. And if I have this, uh, that should make them, that should keep them from doing that. Because I don't want, I don't want like heavy trucks to drive on this road. Because that means they're going through town and clogging up traffic. I want them to use the highway. It takes longer, but the highway, that's what the highway is used for. Like that's the, that's why you have a, high, a highway. Or you should like at least go around the edges, you know. Okay, that's all good. Well, my income just took a massive, like, rise. What the hell? What's happening? <laughs> Where am I getting all the money from? Oh, people, oh, people have moved in. Sick. Uh, damn, that means we need to expand, too. Um, I mean, we could make a small village here. Same as this, you know? Like if we do something like, because if, if they can come in on the national road, um, that means normal people should be able to do that too, right? We could add like a small tram thing so this red one could like also travel over. The highway perhaps yeah that could be fun let's do that uh so this one will go outside like this and then we split community and then houses no. Houses. Um, do we need any industry here, maybe? I mean, they can commute to other industry areas, you know? Especially, especially if we add the tram here. 
If we're doing this, we may as well go like whole hog. So now people can walk, like again, and we can also again like exp expand the tram out here perhaps, like over the farming areas and into he here. Do they have water? No, they don't. We can fix that. We're, we should uh, increase our water supply. So we might as well do that while we're doing it. And our water treatment. Let's just make this a, like a little, just a little suburban area. No industry, small shops, nothing else. Um, like that. We can always expand that if necessary. <laughs> Oh, there are actually workers at the, at the oil pump, so someone's working here. Oh, actually, let's name this. We need to bless this with like a pebble. <laughs> um, egg, egg, egg rock hill. Because they're close to egg, and we can give them an egg, an egg rock. Let's give them an egg. That looks like an egg. Egg, 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 egg. They cannot be used on a, a river with a tide, yeah. Oh yeah, that makes sense, yeah, because then that, that fucks with them. I'm so happy with this, oh my god, you, you have no idea. I'm gonna build a bus also to deal with like small things. We, again, we, I keep, st I s need to stop saying again. Um, a tram right, right now might be a bit much to like expand, uh, but if the need arises, we'll do that. But I'm gonna build a sort of like biofuel bus depot. How are we doing otherwise when it comes to our traffic? They're all thriving. They all have passengers. They're all doing well. That's perfect. There's just people walking around. That's amazing. This is exactly what I wanted. Exactly what I wanted. And we're less than a thousand away from high density. And when we get high density, I'm gonna do like a small change somewhere and then I'm gonna quit the stream because I am a bit tired. I have been streaming for three hours, but I'm gonna quit the stream. I'm gonna raid someone else, you know? But we've gotten like very far actually in this. Um, way further than I thought we would, and I'm very happy about that. Uh, bus, nice. Mm, let's add, a, we can just add like a bus line between Flat Rock Farms, Egg Rock Hill and Egg. So people who have to commute from like up here, I don't know how many people work in Egg up here, but if they do, they can like take a tram here, they can take another tram here, they can take a bus here. So it's two transfers, so it's not great. Um, but you know, they can, they can, they can do that. So like they can stop. 
Like that can stop here. Like in the middle of town, turn around, keep going to egg. Uh, turn around and just go home. I think that's fine. It's very expensive for one bus line, but... Egg line. You know, we might have more buses in the future, and we always need a depot, so I think that's worth it. Let's expand this industrial area. It has 31 wor 33 workers, even 35, look at that. And we also have, like, ways that they can walk, uh... They can even walk all the way up here, so I don't think anyone's doing that. I mean, some people are, but not a lot. I think the bus is going to be a welcome addition to this like little little area. And we have the we have downtown, which is like looking more and more like a like a, like city. We have this, which is like a small town, and we have egg, the tiny tiny egg, flat rock. And uh, big rock. This is excellent. Can I the very center of the egg to the yolk? <laughs> uh, I, I I can if I do something like yolk. <sighs> uh, we have fun. I'm gonna expand this industry a little bit because there is oil outside too. And to separate it. Look at that. Oh, running out of power again. Uh, but this area is actually like flat enough to actually pick up some wind. So we can do another wind, like a little wind farm here. Let's check traffic. Traffic here is a bit dense, most likely because of the trams and the buses that are coming in. This is a bit intense as well. Like in and out of the bridge is a, like express route. But th th our main town is looking amazing. Uh, it, it is here where like most issues sort of arise, especially this one. So I'm going to do the the literal best solution to deal with traffic and delete the road. It is the best solution to dealing with traffic. Like objectively. If it didn't know more 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 traffic causes more cars, more roads cause more traffic. A statement that is literally true in every in almost every single scenario. So sometimes you see people who want to like deal with extreme um, extreme traffic by like, oh, let's just expand the overpass, add more lanes to the to the highway. Doesn't work. It adds more. Oh, we should change the details of this. Oh my god, there's so many buses. Why are there so many buses? We don't need this many buses. We don't need 10 buses for this short ride. We can have five. You're yellow. You're a yellow bus. Okay, let's more more oil. Mm, we need more workers. I mean, we we're, we're getting more workers, but we need more. What else can we build? Main building, crude oil storage tank. Let's store some crude oil, shall we? We should do a sludge, oil sludge pyrolysis plant. And we can produce petroleum with that. Interesting. I think traffic is improving. Honestly, can't tell. I'm gonna make this road a one-way which is almost like removing a road but not quite 
And that is why people have um, those types of roads. Let's, also, let's make this four lane, because why not? Oh, it won't work, because this is a two lane anyway. Uh, that, that'll clog it up even more. We need to do something like that. We can do this. Four lane works like here, but it won't work here. It's flying fairly okay. I like that. I don't, I don't hate that. With breaking up city civil traffic, you have urban sprawls that take some of the largest areas and even organize them into separate towns. Kind of, yeah. Like that is a, that is one way to do to do it. A big problem with like urb, urbanization as it stands right now is that it's just like big. <laughs> Cities are just built in a, in a sense of like, there's one center and then there's just everyone wants to be in the center, but that doesn't work necessarily. There should be many small centers everywhere that people can go to. Sweden did that for a while when they expanded uh, the cities during the, uh, like during the Cold War. When Sweden stopped being poor as fuck. Um, and Sweden started experimenting with like, hey, let's... Like let's let's have every like part of Stockholm like have its own like center of town where it's like their own shopping areas, their own like le leisure areas, stuff like that. So not everyone wants to go to the center all the time, but obviously there are always reasons why people want to be in the center that aren't necessarily connected to you know shopping and leisure and stuff like that. Take a loan, fix power. <laughs> How does our upgrading? You just need 500 more people to move into the city. And I will be good. Hmm. Why not? Who's going to stop me? Sorry that I'm just rambling on, on my own. Oh, I should check on something. I'll be back in a little bit. Look at this game though, it's so beautiful. We, we started from nothing and now we're here. Some small oil derricks. I mean, we are producing petroleum, so that's good. Is egg making profit? Kind of, not really. What do we need? We need more workers in egg. And the buses are starting to deliver people. So we are getting somewhere. Oh, we for uh, uh, no, we have egg. I, 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 for a second, I thought we forgot to bless Egg Rock Hill, but no, we have egg. It has an egg. It's all good. Every town needs a blessing. What happened to the sinkhole we got earlier, by the way? Did we build over that, like by accident, or is it still here somewhere? Oh, I, I think this. Is, yeah, there it is. <laughs> he has a smaller house. A little hole. There's 300 more people. We can we can fit that in somewhere. Surely. 
we can expand this sort of residential area a fair bit. We can even do something like this. I want to keep it away from the highway as much as possible because it's obviously loud. People don't like that. Uh, da, 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 da. Speedy-ass train? Freight train, really? Oh, it's a timber, it's a timber train, okay. Oh, just 10 more workers and then this will level up a little bit. Once you can start doing like specialized factories, you're you're gonna be like soaring in money, which is very very nice. Power through yoking glass. Ah, oh, come on, we're so close. I just wanna. I, I, at this point, it's not really about the game anymore. I just kind of wanna finish the stream. <laughs> Crime rate is low. We should have a sheriff in town. Trying to build like nice parks so people will come here to live. <sighs> oh, it's for the industrial area. Okay. Now I can make big oil derrick oil oil rigs. Can I make a unique factory yet? Household plastic. So I need to make plastics and petroleum. I think. Yeah, pet I need to make uh, petroleum and, and petrochemicals. Well, plastic, yeah. So if I can do that, I can make the unique factory, which I will also build in this area, by the way, uh, of uh, making plastics. And then this town will just export plastics. Building houses, they're building houses. Everybody's building houses. Where can where can I sneak in another house? I can sneak in a few houses here perhaps. On the cliff's edge. What's uh Make some let's make some plastics they both just crave raw material that's okay finding a good point to stop is yeah that's kind of what I'm struggling with too like I always, I just want to expand everything, you know? Oh, they don't have water? Well, it sucks. How is that my problem? <laughs> oh, you're a mayor, mayor. Well, who elected me, huh? Exactly. We are getting more workers, though, and this is going to help us produce plastics, so that's good, too. I, I'm really, really happy with this town, actually. I feel like I always play City Builder better uh, when I when I have a, have an audience to, like... So I always feel like I have someone to perform to, you know? I think this bridge is operating much better now, with less heavy traffic at least. I don't think it is free of heavy traffic, but it is working with less. 
the tram system seems to be working perfectly and we just got a massive like increased need to for houses so that's probably gonna help a little bit i'm just gonna put people on the cliff's edge fuck it i just i need, need i need souls i wonder what happened massive like high demand for residential it's been like puttering it low for a long time Come on, come on. If I get high density, I, I don't need to worry about like houses, uh, like residents ever again, because I can just build up one apartment building and get 400 people. <gasps> come on, come one more. Just one more. <sighs> Big town. Big town, cool. Uh, let's, we can make campuses now. We can all make all sorts of shit. Let's make, uh, I wanna show you, I wanna show you a small thing. So I'm gonna change this area into a high density uh, thing. I'm gonna change this area into a high density that. And I'm gonna change, I'm gonna put some offices here. Sure. And then we have all new things here, for example. Cause I just wanna show you what the mod does. Under construction. Yeah, so this, see, 11. 11 can be held in here. 10, 12. And this is based on like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then like, you know, some of these are double, obviously, and some of them are, you know how, you know how it is. And like, this will increase massively. And yeah, sure, like maybe seven is a bit low, low for this. But what I can do if I want to, is I can just, yeah, so it calculates home based on the width of the building, uh, the length, the calculated area, and like a, squ a normal square meter per person and what they need. And how big, how high the floors are and how many floors it has. So it does, it does like a calculation of how many people would, how many households would live here. But if I want to, I can just add my own settings. I can just say that this is like, no, actually this building should have 32 people and then 32 people, people will live there. Um, Assuming, of course, you do it realistically. But again, 12, like two of these, two of these blocks is in this one building. This is- The Coast Guard is warning of a tsunami approaching the area. Residents should avoid roads and waterfronts. What? The tsunami has struck the city. Take caution and avoid roads and waterfronts until the water recedes. I'm just giving a reminder to myself. <sighs> Surfing time. <laughs> well, okay. Well, that was a good stream. That was a good stream, friends. I have saved. That was really fun. Three hours of that. Holy sh... Three and a half hours. Holy shit. It's almost midnight. I need to make a pizza very, very uh, quietly in my apartment now. Who should we raid? This was a good stream, though. I like this. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I have a mercury. I have a small pizza that I have to put in the oven very, very quietly because I have roommates and they're sleeping. Ugh, if the game can fucking end. Where's my phone? I have no idea where my phone is. Oh, that's a shame. I hope I didn't leave it at the store. Do -do 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 -do. Who is online? I have to go to Twitch <laughs> in order to in order to do that. <laughs> today has been today has been very fun. Um, let's send you all to. Can I go to create a panel? Yeah. I'm gonna send all of you to a person who is not my friend, but who I admire very much and who is a very, very good content creator. I'm gonna send you all to Steph. Who's playing Assassin's Creed. Uh, give her my love. And I'll see you all uh, in two days when I will play another game on stream. This, this has been fun. Uh, watch my videos, please.